What up, you guys? So, of course, I'm sitting in traffic, and I figured I would share my random thoughts with you guys today. My cubby buddy and I somehow got on the subject of breeding. It stemmed from race, and then it turned into breeding. And, well, breeding is what I call it. One question that I am asked more than anything else is, what am I? Apparently, human is not an acceptable answer. They want to know what your ethnicity is. And white isn't a good answer either, apparently. Needless to say, my mother is white. I believe her family is Irish, German, whatever. I don't know. I don't get onto all that because I don't really care. Um, my father's mother is also my father's mother is also of a Caucasian background. Um, I'm not exactly sure where and what and who and how, but my father's father, my father's father, my papa, is where my olive complexion comes from. My dark hair, my dark eyes. My great grandmother was born on a reservation. She was later adopted off of this reservation and raised in Canada, in Toronto. Um, she was then married five times within her life, and my papa never knew his dad. So, that being said, I, I don't know. I am completely okay with just being myself. I don't feel like I need to identify with any one particular group. Um, I feel like I'm a... Can I just identify with being American, considering like we are a melting pot of just all kinds of ethnic backgrounds and nationalities and all of the above? I don't even know how we got to here, to this place. I do that sometimes. I start on one subject and I end up on something completely different. It's terrible. So, in case y'all care, there you have it. So my cubby buddy and I were having a randomly deep conversation on our break and we got into the subject of breeding. And I call it that and she, she could not have conversation with me because she couldn't get over the fact that I call it breeding. Either you are good breeding or bad breeding. And she felt like we are not animals. In true Tony fashion, I wanted an explanation why she felt like breeding wasn't the proper term and for her to give me the term that she would prefer to use. Where oh, she's coming from, here's the thing. You have a dog. You spent a lot of money on this dog, whatever. You want to breed this dog with another dog and you have certain criteria that you want. Would it not be, not be the same thing? Is that not the technical term if you are wanting certain attributes for your child? Is that not breeding? You told me to say, just say, make a baby. Make a baby isn't where I'm going with this. Make a baby is just making a baby that's boring and lame. I would like to breed. <laughs> Obviously, when you're making a baby, you know, that's uh, supposed to be done passionately, whatever, because you love that person. Okay, cool. Me, if I'm going to be single the rest of my life and I decide I want another child, then I'm going to look for someone with, you know, good breeding. And then I might throw a proposal out. I'm like, yo, hey, what's up? I won't take a child support if you just give me a tall, beautiful child. So, obviously, I'm going to look for a man. So stupid. So find me a tall man who has maybe the most beautiful eyes you've ever seen and a good complexion. And we hope for the best that it works, that our genes connect and we work and we don't come out looking like, you know, a retarded dog. So, you know, either it works or it doesn't. But I guess my question is more so like, do you guys feel the way that she feels? Do you feel like breeding is an offensive term in regards to baby making <laughs> when you're looking to Read a child of a of a certain look. Like if you want to have a tall kid, you're obviously going to breed with somebody tall. Is breeding not the right term? Is that what would you? You guys, my shenanigan rant is over. I will uh, I'll wait for your response so that I can you know tell her I'm correct. I don't feel like breeding is offensive. I feel like the particular topic that we were talking about that it's appropriate. I feel like yes, it's in the same terms as what animals be done as, but is it any different? beautiful puppies that you're able to sell or whatever, then you breed with another beautiful dog. If you want beautiful babies, then you breed with, you know, if you want your babies to look a certain kind of way, you breed with that kind of person. Let me clarify on a couple of things real quick before the shenanigans really starts. I am not trying to have a baby anytime soon. I was sim simply talking about a hypothetical situation. Um, not that I want to breed with anybody, but I kept referring to it as breeding and Hypothetical situation ended up on a whole nother discussion upon breeding and the makes of me versus the makes of somebody else and a combination of us breeding. What the discussion to which term would you use? That's where this whole thing came from. I am not looking to breed. I am not shallow. I just, if I want to have a child, of course I've given myself till 32, so chances of me having another baby is very slim to none because I want to be married and in love. I'm not going to be looking for. 
not basing my next relationship off of breeding material at all. That's not it. In my next relationship, if we have a connection, we have a connection. The way that you look is not a factor. Obviously, there's a mutual attraction there. We wouldn't be together. We should probably be in love. If we decide that we want to have a child, I'm not going to look at you and be like, none of your bad breeding. Like, that's not how this works. The breeding conversation came up in the event that I stay single, I do decide I want a child, and I go that route, then our breeding comes into play. Because at this point, I get to pick and choose. I'm not in love with this person. More than likely, it's probably a sperm donor from a sperm bank. And I'm raising this baby on my own. So, you guys, it's a hypothetical situation. The thought of children in my life at this point is not even a factor. My daughter is more than enough. I've got plans in the world to, to learn and explore. Um, so, yeah. I don't need... I don't need dimples and height and green eyes and like that's later on down the road in the event that I haven't you know found love not that I'm looking for it but it hadn't fallen in my lap and you know we'll go that escalated quickly <laughs> I'm gonna go run this bridge you guys have a beautiful Wednesday and